at the stroke of midnight hour when the world sleeps india shall awake to life and freedom but this freedom did not come easy it demanded for both blood and sweat the struggle continued from 1612 to 1947 what we see as freedom today reflects the hard work and dedication of our nationalists now let's go back in time to see what our nationalists actually went through to make india an independent country 1920 for an uncertain period of indian national movement after jallianwala park tragedy gandhi ji started non cooperation movement and it became the biggest mass movement of the country however then came chori chora incident and mahatma suspended the non cooperation february 1928 Simon Commission arrived and was met with widespread protest as there was no Indian representative. British in their arrogance thought that Indians were incapable of self-rule. The annual session of Indian National Congress met at Lahore in 1929 and voted for a historic resolution of complete independence of Munisvara. In 1930 Gandhi ji started Dandi march from Sabarmati ashram to Dandi a coastal town of Gujarat as a protest against the infamous salt law imposed by britishers Gandhi ji and his followers broke the salt law and this marked the beginning of the another movement the civil disobedience movement on 8 August Gandhi launched Quit India movement he gave the slogan do or die It was a massive blow to the British regime. 